Clark looking for her first points of the game. Down the lane, she gets the layup to go and will step, but that's, an, that's a call and a, and a losing battle. She's She's been playing that way for her entire... And the Badgers are up by four. Martin to a cutting Clark for two. And another whistle. Is she's finishing through contact at a higher clip than she was her first few years. She would have missed be close. She injured her knee last November. Was lost for the entire season. Only played in five games and only played three minutes in that outing yesterday. There goes Clark. In. That sort of physicality and, and aggressiveness that she's seeing from Copa. Carson Mosley told us they mostly want to try to frustrate Caitlin Clark. Make her take tough shots. Don't give her any open looks. So far, they've mostly been able to do that. Although Clark finds space in a heartbeat, doesn't she? Look at the scene when Caitlin Clark and the Hawkeyes come to town. You're in Iowa City or something. Second difference between shot and game clocks. The switch on Clark. Three to shoot for a falter. Clark will heave it and drop it from Wayne. Earlier, how important she has been to this team since the Kansas State loss. Her scoring has skyrocketed, and they've gone undefeated 6-0 since. Look at Caitlin Clark split everybody. What you want to do offensively, but yes, you're very well aware of it. You have someone on the bench that's keeping track things like that. <laughs> Kaylin Clark. I mean, you've got one job is to shoot it. Okay, a former Nebraska Gatorade Player of the Year. Here's Clark from deep. Ball game, and these are, they're not kids, but they're young adults, and they're supposed to have fun playing this game. She finds a way to have a lot of fun playing this game. And we have a lot of fun watching her <laughs> play this game. Look at that pass. My goodness, can the Hawkeyes they just haven't had the chance because of the foul trouble. And she's playing with four. Clark from deep. 